Hello and you're watching Sony's Portable Reader System PRS700 video review. On the top side we have the light indicator, the power up switch, a memory stick reader and SD memory card reader. On the side we have a stylus so you can browse through pages or just uh, add notes or anything else. On the bottom side you have the volume rocker to increase the volume or decrease it and the next to it is the headphone jack a USB connection to charge it and to transfer files and also a DC in to charge the device two settings for light and hand style here I'm showing how to disconnect the device from the cover it's very easy to do as you can see uh, now we'll browse some books it comes with 15 books and 100 book if you are in USA uh, for example we are now running a book you can change the pages by pressing the keys down the next page key or you can use the stylus to move forward or your hand or your fingers if you yeah, as I'm showing, if you hold down, it will go forward, passing through the pages. If you click Options, you will see a set of options. For example, Table of Contents. If you click it, or select it, you will see the Table of Contents. We have the Zoom feature. If you are using, you can change the text size, medium, small, to medium to large and X large and double X large it's good for old people or people with poor sight or vision usually I use it at small you can bookmark a page by tapping in the corner or uh, there is a feature in the options you can search through your documents for example you're having a dictionary and you want to search for certain words or just a document you want to go to certain or book you want to go to certain um, phrase you want to find how many it's uh, in this page and where is the location of them of those words and we'll go to other you can add or highlight a text for later to read it or to know where this text or it's important word for you or text and you can add note to that highlight for example I am typing now test note and don't worry about the speed you can type as fast as you want it will put it in or fill it in later because the display takes time to refresh that's it if you click the highlighted text you will see your note as you can see the X to close it now I'm installing a memory card with our almost 218 book or PDF files to be exact um, we'll see how long it will take to recognize all the books and put them in their places and also there is some music files and pictures it doesn't take too much as you can see now it's 283 books it used to be 15 only we'll go for pictures you'll you can use or view by thumbnails or uh, by names you can to listen you can choose music to listen to music files mp3 files or AAC files play you can see it's moving the status bar to tell you how long to finish this song or that you can find all the notes or highlighted text here you can make collections of books for example I am here making collections if you have a lot of books it's better to make collections you can go through by names now I am describing or showing the built-in uh, light 
the side light it's not backlighted it's on the sides as you can see but it's really quite good in the dark to read I'm showing another document with with some Arabic text now I will show you some zoom feature in PDF files this is great other devices the previous device didn't have zoom in in PDF files so this is important for me as well the search feature so double tap the location or there is a rocker to zoom in and out uh, to zoom in to the location you want to move or uh, to yeah to move the image or the file or the document you are zoom in to move around you just tap hold and move like you're dragging the page so drag the page around to see the text or where you want to see it. to exit the zoom mode just click next or return of the zoom key again